I think I didn't do a very good job explaining what was going on. If this is a reaction somebody got, I need to like go more in depth. First off, let's make thing one really clear. She wasn't put on trial because she Googled a defense lawyer. Second of all, she wasn't under arrest when she made the Google search. It was in between the trooper contacting her for an interview and being interviewed by law enforcement. Also, what was being talked about this morning when I made that video was an argument being made outside of the jury that um, the prosecution wanted to talk about her Google searches um, while the, one of the phone experts was on the stand. The judge didn't allow it because just like you asking for an attorney during an interview can't be used against you, it's kind of the same idea. I was talking about it because I thought her Googling that really showed her state of mind at that moment. It shows what she was concerned about. It shows what she thought she could be charged with. Um, and I think that's interesting and it really shows that she wasn't concerned about any kind of collision with her car and John. What she was concerned about was the fact that she had been drinking and driving. And I think that's really a powerful thing and I know the jury doesn't get to see it, but I still think it's, it's an interesting tidbit to know about. So no, you can't be put on trial for Googling a defense counsel. You just like you can't, it can't be held against you that you ask for an attorney or that you don't testify at your same, at your trial. Those, this wasn't something the jury had actually heard. The arguments I was talking about was outside the presence of the jury.